What is up guys, welcome back to another video. I am very excited to make this video because I finally like finalized all of my desk setup. So without further ado, I am going to take you through my dream desk setup. So starting off on the side over here, this is actually one of the new additions to my desk. This little side drawer like isn't even connected to the desk or anything. To be honest, what ended up happening was like I ran out of space in this drawer that's already built into this desk. So I basically got this little add-on drawer and it just kind of sits on the side of my desk. I think it blends in pretty well. Anyway, I have been like working hard to fully organize all of these drawers. I did that review of bento stack, which, you know, I use in these drawers to help me organize all my stuff. Anyway, I'll take you through this little side one here. So first off on the top here, these are all of my camera accessories. I have some extra cameras in this little partition, some Canon point and shoots. Here's my old baby, the Sony HDR CX500. This camera has been very good to me for, I think, I think like five or six years. We also got a bunch of cables. We have some extra little shoe accessories and stuff. Here are all of my chargers and this is a little extra Sony microphone. Next up, I actually have an entire drawer dedicated to glasses. I like to keep some extra glasses lying around in case like my main glasses breaks or something. So here are some of my old glasses in their cases. This here is actually like a bunch of glasses, accessories and stuff. I have some glasses that don't even have prescription. So basically, hipster glasses. These are my sunglasses. And then moving on to this last drawer. This drawer is for all of my cases and stuff. I have my switch case. These are some camera bags that I use whenever I need to take my cameras out with me. So that's this little side drawer. I like to use the top to put all of my extra stuff. Here are some extra Funko Pop figures that didn't fit in storage. So now let's move on to the actual desk. This massive beast of a desk has been a part of my bedroom ever since I moved into this bedroom, which was about four or five years ago. So starting off on the side over here, these are the drawers that are actually built into this desk. So this top one I usually use for like computer cables. I have a bunch of USB cables all over here. And of course I have my bento stack, which I did a video review on. In this next drawer, I have like a lot of video game related stuff. We have a PlayStation controller for when I play any kind of games on my Mac. I have an Xbox 360 controller, which, you know, also uses USB. There's my Razer mouse. And finally, you're going to have to kind of excuse this last drawer. It's honestly still kind of a mess. But this one, just like the second drawer, it's mostly just miscellaneous video game stuff. Actually, I just bought this little NES pouch, but I just use it for like 3DS chargers and whatnot. Other than that, I guess I have like one of these Atari re-release consoles. And also there's my Sega Dreamcast down there. I bought that from a store for I think like 20 bucks or something. Anyway, those are the drawers on this table. Now moving on to the actual desk itself. I guess I might as well just start with like the main attraction on this desk. This is my triple monitor desktop setup. I'm very, very proud and you know, very, very lucky to have this set up on my desk. So on the left here, this is a Vizio 1080p HD TV and I do actually have it set up so that I can watch TV on this. But for a majority of the time, I just use it as a monitor. <laughs> anyway, moving on to the center here. This is my 2017 4K Retina 21.5 inch iMac. I got this as a present from my mom for Christmas 2017. And this is a beast of a computer. Anyway, moving on to the third monitor here. This is a Sony PlayStation, I believe 23 inch 3D display. I think at this point, this display is actually like discontinued and it's capable of doing 3D, which, you know, I used for like a couple months and it was fun. <laughs> I honestly haven't used the 3D in a while, but this display still is like a really awesome display. And then of course I have just a bunch of accessories littered around my desk. First off, you may have noticed these little like riser things. I bought these off Amazon because these displays are a lot shorter than the iMac. You know, since the iMac has like a built-in hinge, I wanted to get all of my monitors being the exact same height. Now all of my monitors are aligned. This right here is a USB Blu-ray player since Apple got rid of the optical drive in the iMac. So I got this LG one and it works okay. I also have this Belkin 7 port USB 2.0 hub. And then underneath the play 
PlayStation display. I actually have a Sony Blu-ray player. I know it's kind of silly nowadays to have a Blu-ray player, but I still use this a lot. It fits perfectly underneath my PlayStation display, so that's awesome. <laughs> anyway, that is like the main attraction of my desk. The triple monitor setup. I guess really quickly we'll move up here and talk about these little cabinets on top of my desk. So inside of here, I keep all of my DVDs and Blu-rays. Excuse all of this mess. Anyway, this is my DVD and Blu-ray collection. Maybe one day in the future I'll actually go through individually all of these DVDs and Blu-rays. But for now, this is my little collection. And then moving on to this side. This side is actually for all of my books. I'm honestly not really one to read, but I do have some books. This is actually my little collection of Nintendo Force magazine. These magazines are awesome. And then over here we have my collection of 3DS games, which I honestly don't even have that much of, but it's there. And finally, here is the last piece of my desk setup. This is also one of the newest additions to my desk setup. We actually got this little table the same time that we got that little drawer. And in case you can't tell, this piece right here is actually a completely separate table from the actual desk. Like I actually can, you know, move this around and stuff. Anyway, I'm like really excited that I got this little side table because for the longest time, my entire like desk is, you know, occupied by my triple monitors. So I didn't have any place to put my MacBook Pro. I pretty much used this MacBook Pro solely for the purposes of school. Like I put all of my homework and all of my textbooks on this MacBook Pro. So it's really nice to have like this little side table to put my MacBook Pro. This way I can be, you know, doing my homework and also doing whatever on the iMac. It makes me very productive and you know, it's just awesome. <laughs> anyway, you know, this side table just lets me have a whole bunch more room for activities. <laughs> this is actually something I just recently got. This is a wireless charging stand. I can actually put my iPhone 10 on this little stand and it will start charging. I love this wireless charging stand. I got it off Amazon for I think like 20 bucks or something. But I mean, other than that, this side table has just been like such a blessing in my life because it makes me feel a lot more productive and it lets me do a whole bunch more things. All right guys, so that wraps up my little desk tour. This is seriously like my dream desk and I'm so lucky to actually have this be a reality. Let me know what you guys think of my desk setup in the comments. But thank you for watching this video and I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye.